guys, so, uh, quick thing before we get started, I think I owe you guys an explanation. I don't know if you noticed, but today is Thursday, not Wednesday. I hope you've noticed by now, but, uh, I usually upload my videos on Wednesdays, not Thursdays. So then, why, why am I uploading a video on Thursday and not Wednesday? Well, it's a long story. About a year ago, a movie came out, you guys might have heard of it, called The Hobbit, Desolation of Smog. Well, I saw the midnight premiere with one of my friends, and then we liked it, and we were like, hey, next year, we're gonna see the midnight premiere of the third Hobbit movie. So, time goes on, and I slowly develop a schedule for my YouTube channel. That schedule, if you don't know, is I film on Tuesdays, and edit them on Wednesdays, and then upload them on Wednesdays, obviously because I don't have time to do that all on the same day. I just, I don't, and I don't want to do it on the weekends. I don't know why, I totally could, I have so much time, but I just, it doesn't work for me. And so yeah, that, that schedule's worked out really well so far, and I'm happy that I have it. But on Tuesday, uh, I was, you know, I was getting ready to set up to film, and my friend shoots me a text, and they're like, hey, we're on our way to come get you. And I was like, oh f Fuck me. Because I had already purchased my tickets and all, that wasn't that wasn't the problem. It was that I didn't even know that I was seeing it on Tuesday. I thought I was seeing it on Thursday. Today. But that was that was not the case. And so I'm panicking because I've got homework to do that I haven't done. And I have to film this video and I have to get all, all these things done and I won't have time to do it all on the same day on Wednesday and then, you know, what about the homework and I'm gonna get back late because Hobbit movies are very long. They're like three hours long. So I called my dad up on the phone and I was like, hey dad, so here's my, my sitch, my situation. And he was like, well that sucks, lecture, 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 lecture. And I was like, dad, I didn't call for a lecture. I don't know what I did wrong, but that pissed him off. So we get to the movie theater, and I look at I look at the time, and I'm like, oh my god, the movie starts in an hour and a half. Why are we here so early? And they're like, oh well, well the movie there's it's it's uh, there's probably gonna be a line, you know, into the theater. And I'm not eager to go in the movie theater. Because I don't know if you guys know this, but once you once you get your ticket all ripped and whatever, you can't leave the movie theater un you know until you see your movie, unless you don't want to watch the movie, then you can leave. But if you want if you want to watch the movie, you can't leave the movie theater until you watch it. So so we go and we get a hamburger. That was a really really good hamburger. But but we go back and eventually we're just like you know what we're gonna go into the movie theater. So we go in and I get my ticket all scanned up and whatever. And then I realized that because it's an hour and a half before the movie, they haven't opened up the theater yet. It's not available for us to sit in. Then we look around and we notice there's a line of people. And who is at the front of the line but the people who dress up for movies, you know? They've got, th these people have like the whole elvish outfit on and they've got these baskets full of this bread. Because like elvish, I don't f know, but it was, it was some kind of bread wrapped up in these paper leaves. It's kind of adorable, actually, but, but, why? I mean, they had three baskets of this stuff, and I counted the people, there were like seven people in line. Counting them! Who were they planning to give this fucking bread to? I don't know. But they handed me some bread, and I was like, swag, thanks. Pop that in my pocket, go on with my day. So, uh, I liked the movie, but I realized I was very angry, because I actually would have gotten this video up yesterday, if she hadn't picked me up a fucking hour and a half early. All right, onward. So I wanna talk about something, cause that's what I do in my videos, I talk. Basically, there's something I think you should know. It's December. It's been December for a little while now. That means that Christmas is very soon. In fact, a week away. But unfortunately, some people do not share the excitement that I I contain in inside me. Some people don't care. They don't, they don't, they don't care. Even with Mariah Carey's mess up at the Rockefeller Center this year, even with all the Christmas music and the Christmas themed everything everywhere, they don't care. They don't look forward to Christmas and I have one question for them. Un, uno pregunto. 
Why? 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 Side note, if you had some bad Christmas-related memory or something, I totally understand why you would not look forward to Christmas. If I were in your shoes, I wouldn't look forward to it either, so that's totally okay if you don't look forward to it. Anyway, please do not get all... Oh, oh, but some people, they, they can't afford presents. Because let me just remind you that Christmas is not about presents. Sure, it has a lot of gift-giving things involved, but it's mainly about spending time with your family, you know, having a good time with them. Gifts just have to be involved with that. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna read you the definition of Christmas. Siri, define Christmas. Let me think about that. From two definitions of Christmas, the first one is period extending from December 24th to January. That was really disappointing, Siri. I f hate you. Dictionary.com saves lives. I've got the definition right here, so. Christmas is the annual festival of the Christian church commemorating the birth of Jesus. Side note, Christmas was originally like a, a Christian slash Catholic slash whatever holiday, but it doesn't have to be related to that. You don't even have to celebrate it if you don't want to, but like, celebrated on December 25th and now generally observed as a legal holiday and an occasion for exchange gifts. Let me read you that again. It is now observed as a legal holiday. A holiday. Let's brainstorm other holidays. Let's think, oh, oh, a 4th of July. If, you're living, if you live in America. Bonfire night, I think that's what it's called in the UK. So that, that's two different holidays. Uh, Thanksgiving, again, if you live in America. If you don't, I, I don't think you guys have a Thanksgiving or something like that anywhere else. There, there's Christmas, that, that is the thing. Uh, your birthday. That, that's technically a holiday. Cinco, Cinco de Mayo. Hanukkah. Uh, Kwanzaa. Lots of different holidays, okay? And a, a majority of those are not about gifts. I mean, a couple of them, I think, are. But like Thanksgiving and, and Bonfire Night and, and Fourth of July, those are all about being with your family. They aren't about exchange gifts. They, they are about exchanging food. But, but it is mainly about being with your family and and all that jazz. And if you put gifts before your family, I think you should rethink your priorities. Because that is not how you should do things. You can replace gifts, but you can't replace your family. As cheesy as that sounds, you, you know it's true. So uh, on that note, I wish you guys the merriest of Christmases and the happiest of Hanukkahs. And what other winter holidays are going on right now? Also, I should probably tell you that next week I will be in another part of the country, kind of remote, kind of not, but the place that I'm going has a very limited amount of Wi-Fi that each person can use, and I will exceed that amount if I try to upload a video. That means that I can't upload a video next week. Have a nice day, bye!